It did uh, everybody spot the uh, picture? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so uh, I thought rather yeah. than the usual quiz question, because obviously I normally start off with a quiz question before we kick off. Yeah, um, sure. I thought we'd do this um, yeah. spot the difference picture. It was actually very kindly sent in yeah. by Richard Gulliver. Um, so there's five um, differences for you to spot and um, we'll, uh, we'll have the answers at the end. But uh, I found it a bit tricky to start with, but uh, got them all in the end. So hopefully you managed to find all five. Right then, folks. So uh, welcome, everybody. Um, we're all here today for a talk from Jeff Bates on water gardens and water features. And today's talk has been arranged by Evesham Gardens and Country Group. So thank you very much to them. Right. Um, just a quick one. The subtitles are switched on if you want to have them. So at the bottom of the screen, you should see an icon that says live transcript. So you can click on that and then you'll get uh, subtitles appearing on the screen as well. Um, our next couple of talks um, are coming up in March and April. So the next one is on the 23rd of March. So put that in your diaries. That's a Wednesday. And that's from Margaret Easter. And the topic is using herbs over the centuries. And then the one after that is April the 13th, which is a Wednesday. And that top, and that's from um, Richard Harvey. The topic is um, yet to be decided, but make sure you've got those dates in your diary. Um, if you want to drop us an email, that's the email address, and then we can let you know when those talks are happening and what the subjects are. Um, and also, just one last thing from me. Um, na we, local to where I am, we've got the National Collection of uh, Cherry Blossom. Um, it's at uh, Keele University. There is another collection down in Sittingbourne in Kent. Um, and the reason I'm I'm highlighting this now is because um, some of the cherry blossom is actually coming into bloom. Um, the main part of the season is actually um, sort of you know April time, but um, if you look at the um, Keele University website, some of the cherry blossom is about to start uh, to come into bloom. So what I'm going to do is in, shortly in the chat box, I will put in a link to Keele University website. So if you fancy making a trip over the next several weeks, it's definitely worth having a look. Um, there's no sort of fee or anything to get in. Um, you can just drive around the campus and have a look at uh, all the cherry blossom that's that's there. Um, there's a guide that you can use, um, which uh, explains um, all about the, the cherry blossom and also a map. So I'll put those in as well uh, into the chat box so you can have a look at those um, as well as a, a flowering timetable as well. So if you want to time your visits to when the cherry blossoms in flower, um, you can use that as well. Right then, so I'm now going to uh, hand over to Chaz, if Chaz is there, um, and then Chaz can um, introduce Jeff for us. Okay. Yeah. Um, yes, I, I'm sure a lot of you already know Jeff, uh, but for those of you who may not have come across him before, uh, Jeff started many years ago as an apprentice in the uh, Queen's uh, Crown Estate in Windsor, and then Travelled with several jobs around the country in Suffolk and Liverpool and Yorkshire before finally settling in Derby to become a lecturer in horticulture. Um, he did that for 22 years before he decided he would uh, set up his independent uh, design consultancy and uh, also um, specialised in pruning uh, specialist plants. So with many years experience, um, both as chairman and president of the East Midlands in Bloom, and also uh, the Britain in Bloom as an RHS judge, uh, he's very well qualified to talk about, about many, many aspects. And today, um, I'm sure uh, he's gonna give us a very uh, entertaining and informative talk on water gardens and water features. So with that, I'll hand over to Jeff. Thank you, Jeff. What the plan is then is to talk about why we do this, why we have water gardens and water features, what's the benefits, and to look at the practicalities. Hi folks, I'll just give you the final slide. Um, just a quick reminder, um, our next two talks, um, March the 23rd, which is a Wednesday, put that in your diaries, and that's Margaret Easter, and then the one after that is April the 13th, um, and that's from Richard Harvey. Um, as usual, guests are very welcome to our um, talks. Um, if anybody would like to make a donation um, to help us um, keep these talks running, those are the bank account details, and it usually is on the bottom of emails as well, if um, if you want to have a look there, um, and that would be very that would be fantastic. I'm just going to give you the final quick answer. Right then, so did anybody get all five? 
Yep. Yeah. You did? Yeah. Okay, fine. Do you want to talk us through them then? Yeah, if you look at the, um, the one on the left, there's two chairs. <clears throat> um, uh, with the picture, there's in the middle here, because you've got the thing on the end, there's some more plants growing in here, in the middle. Yep. Um, and I can't see the full picture. There's, there's a shrub here that's, yep. that's growing here, which is oh, in this one. Robin there. And there's a yep. robin, yeah, there's a robin uh, there. No, and, no. and a gnome. And a gnome. <laughs> that's it. There you are. That's, that's a lot. And that's up there. Yeah. Did you show the phone? The difference between the two pictures. Oh, yeah. I see. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, good. Excellent. Sounds like uh, quite a lot of you got those. Um, but uh, yeah, fantastic. That was uh, sent in to me. Show by... that one and that one. With the show them. Not the beginning. That was sent in to me by Richard okay. Gulliver, one of our members. So thank you very much, Tim. I don't know if he's here today, but, uh, but thank you. Right then, folks. Um, so I will uh, say goodbye if anybody wants to leave now, and hopefully I'll see you uh, on the next talk. Uh, and I'll open up the breakout rooms now. So I'll say goodbye. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers indeed. Thank Bye. you. Cheers. Bye. Cheers. Bye. Bye.